Hey, this is Joshua Stern with Keller Williams Realty, the Stern team, and my focus is to keep you current on all things real estate, so when it comes to your own buying, selling, investing, or refinancing goals, you make a good decision. So, here's the deal. There are two sides to every story. Um, last week, we did the uh, blog kind of looking at maybe the upward trend of the market and possibly a turnaround. This time, we're gonna look at what I call the flip side. Um, so, this is in relation to our overall health of the Wasatch Front real estate market. So, feel free to go back and watch that blog if you'd like. But right now, I'm gonna give you kind of the alternative look at what may be problematic for the health of our real estate market. According to a recent uh, report by Inman News' Mike Delpreet, new listings coming available to the market have dropped by 40% nationally. There's uh, been some recovery since the shutdown. However, the velocity of that recovery has slowed greatly in recent weeks. We're still down 18% nationally over last year's number. So the problem there is that when new listings stop coming to the market, overall supply begins to drop. There are less homes that are available for buyers to choose from and ultimately purchase. Nationally, the number of active listings is down 25% as of June 21st. The slope of the line is bad news. As you can see, it is heading down and heading down far quicker than it did the same time last last year. Now, let's look at Utah's mar uh, Utah market's active listings. Um, you can see here that we're down about 37% in active listings available on the market over this same time last year. This is the time of year in Utah that we'd normally see a trend of upward, uh, an upward trend in active listings. However, the trend is the opposite of what we need. The active listings across Utah is very much on a downward slope, a mere opposite of what we saw this same time last year. And, and I don't see that improving anytime soon. This is not unique to Utah. A strikingly similar downward sloping trend is seen in most of the major metropolitan areas across the country. In fact, active listings have simply plummeted nationwide in the last few weeks. So why is this significant? Well, it's because the drop in active listings is a disruption to the market dynamics of supply and demand. If the amount of active buyers remains constant, the inventory drops, home prices will rise, which if you're a seller is a good thing Thing, but if our market is driven by those who are willing to buy, the willingness to buy will begin to decrease as buyers become frustrated or burned out in competing with offers on every property and ultimately their motivation changes and they begin to drop out. Supply and demand will change as motivation changes with buyers' willingness to buy. Fewer buyers will begin to tilt the scales of the economy the other direction. So that is a distinct possibility and one that we're certainly going to need to pay close attention to. Real estate dynamics typically take around 90 days uh, to show up, meaning the activity or lack of activity that we see today, it, it could show us more in terms of motivation 90 days from today. That coupled with an increase in COVID-19 cases throughout Utah and most of the, the um, states in the country um, could be problematic for the health of real estate. So there you have it. Two potential and very different outcomes could show up in the next 90 days based upon the two most recent blogs that I've written. Now, you know I can't tell the future, but I can tell you if you're looking to sell now, is a very good time to do that. If you're looking to buy, as many are, make sure you're working with a competent lender as well as a very good buyer specialist to help you navigate these difficult waters with interest rates at, or maybe even below 3%. If you can buy, then definitely buy now. If you need to talk with a skilled agent and ask questions about your own real estate goals, please don't hesitate to give us a call. There's no pressure to buy, there's no pressure to sell, no long-term contracts, nothing like that that you need to worry about, and we'll keep our conversations confidential. So give me a ring, send me an email, and you'll be amazed at how fast I get back to you.